Hi y'all, welcome back to another episode of uh, Let's Try Some Strange Food and See If It's Edible. Uh, today we've got uh, fake tuna. It's Loma Linda, Loma Linda, sustainable plant-based uh, based protein. Tuna, Thai sweet chili. Plant-based tuna alternative, no bones about it. <laughs> uh, yeah, blah, 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 blah. Flavored with red chili, onion, and garlic. Serve on crackers and sandwiches or use as a topping for salads. Do not microwave in crowds, blah, blah, blah. Made with soy protein and then a bunch of, you know, Water, sugar, onion, red chili, onion flavor, blah, blah, blah. It's any good? Let's see. Uh, I got my handy camping fork. Might not be able to tell, but it's a little chilly today. It smells like, uh, and looks like a packet of uh, oil chili. Yeah, I guess kind of looks like a boiled chili. They got pretty close to the texture. But not the taste. Textured soy protein. Yeah, that definitely doesn't taste like tuna. Um, it's, and the, the Thai sweet chili is really mild. Really, really, really. I got some Christmassy Ritz. So let's put this on a Christmassy Ritz. Which would this smell like? And uh, see what, what it do. I'm getting taste of Ritz and Cracker and uh, that's about it. <laughs> really not much flavor at all. The uh, fake tuna, the, the Thai chili, which I like the Thai chili tuna things. No. And honestly, I think I'm more disappointed in the Thai chili than I am the uh, the fake tuna. It's 90 calories if you're on a trail or uh, just need a little calorie meat alternative <laughs> sorry that was a cold chill not a yucky chill um honest um might give it a try um, the, the texture's almost there but you can tell it's fake um, and the Thai chili is just mild, very bland. Anyway, that's it. Um, I've discovered uh, in my experimentations with non-meat uh, um, burgers and on the on the. Blackstone griddle that if it tries to be meat, except for maybe the Impossible Burger, it's a no. <laughs> it, it, it fails. 
if it doesn't try to pretend it's meat that says I'm pure veggie generally they're better um, some of them are actually pretty good um, and remember I'm in a, uh, I'm, I'm looking at this from the standpoint of an omnivore not a vegan or a vegetarian or um, strictly meat guy I'm, I'm an omnivore and uh, that's pretty much held true even with stuff like this if it pretends to be real meat it sucks <laughs> or it's yeah, bland if it just wants to be veggie then they flavor it and it's good and uh, very few times do I find that not to be true anyway it's getting cold and uh, I'm gonna go uh, turn this off and um, get moving, 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 moving. My watch says it's time to move. Give me a sport watch. Anyway, thanks for watching. Y'all have a great day, and uh, see you next time. Bye.